Hey there everyone, I'm Nathan from Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with me, I run my own business helping clients from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones. Here with me today, I have an LG G Flex 2 smartphone with me. And this one's actually been factory reset because if we take a peek here, we can see that we are now being prompted to go through the initial setup wizard. So as we proceed through the steps here, I go past Wi-Fi, then we come to a screen where it says checking connection, so it's running through and verifying things. But then now here we come to a screen that tells us that the phone has been reset and that we have to con to sign in with the Google account that was last used on the device in order to proceed forward. Now this is a security feature implemented by Google in Android 5.1 and up that prevents the phone from being used if it was reset without first removing the Google lock on it. If you've seen some of my other videos, I talk a little bit more about it, so you might have already seen it explained there. So normally we would not be able to proceed at all in this case without having that prior Google account information to log in with. But my business offers a service to be able to remove that lock from this type of phone, and that's actually exactly what I'm going to do here with this one. I'm going to run a quick program here, and then once the phone reboots, we'll be able to see after that that it, the lock is in fact removed, and we can access the phone as normal. Just give me two seconds here to run this. So that's just finishing up, and we can now unplug it, and I'm going to turn it back on here. All right, there we go. So I'm going to give it just a couple seconds to restart here, and then we'll be able to see that the lock is now actually removed. There are several different types of situations where this might happen. Two of the most common, though, are that either you are sold the phone by someone who's dishonest about the phone status and they don't tell you that the lock is enabled on the phone. Or I've also had plenty of clients contact me because they accidentally locked themselves out of their own phone. Uh, the fingerprint reader didn't work or they couldn't remember their screen lock or their child locked them out, etc. And then they had to do a reset, but their Google information wasn't working for some reason or they didn't remember their Google login. So in any case, no matter what, if you have a phone like this with the lock enabled, then I would be able to help you out. As we can see now, as we proceed back through the same setup steps, I'll give it a second here to check whatever it is that it needs to. And then we'll be able to see that instead of being stopped at that lock screen like before, we can actually proceed past. So now the phone's actually asking us for our name, which we never saw before during the setup. We were stopped at that lock screen. So that's a good indication that the lock is actually removed. And now we can keep going through the rest of the options that it asks us to set up. We're just going to go ahead and skip all through them for time's sake and get through to the home screen here as fast as possible. All right, there we are. We are all set. We are now at the main home screen, and this phone can be used just like a normal device now that that Google account lock has been taken off. So, if you have an LG G Flex 2 and would like to get the Google account lock removed off of it, go ahead and get in contact with me. All the contact details will be right in the video description, so just check there for them. Make sure to check out all the other videos on my channel also, as I offer a lot of different services for a lot of different phones, and I'm sure you'll find something there that interests you. Make sure to hit the subscribe button while you're there also, as I'm constantly putting up new videos just like this one, and you definitely want to be notified when that happens. Y para todos los hispanos hablantes, yo también hablo español, así que ustedes no duden en contactarse conmigo. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.